We're now going to use 3D documents to create some vectorial based images of our 3D view for us to be able to then edit later. So once we've got our 3D view saved the way we wanted to, and remember this is being created by saving it as a save view, which has helped us to lock in that orientation so it won't move, we then want to create 3D documents. I'm going to right click new 3D document from the 3D window, and I'll call this Luby, Lobby Entry 3D, and I'll call this one Base. I'll explain that in a minute. So this is creating a vector based, it's still our 3D model, but it's lines and we can export it as lines and the point is it won't rasterize. Once we've got this, we then want to maybe make some changes to it. What are those changes? Where do those changes come from? If we go into our settings, so right click on this 3D document, down the bottom to 3D document settings. There's a lot of things that we can turn on, turn off. For this one, because I'm calling it the base, I actually want to turn off the vectorial 3D hatching. I also don't necessarily want transparency on. It's currently turned off, so that's fine. And I don't want sun and shadows, so I want those off as well. So everything is, there's also one that's called hidden edges, which we can play with later. At the moment, I don't want that one. And finally, we could change it to pen 1 or pen 21 or something like that. I want it to be black. 21 is good because it's a little bit thicker. The thickness of the line doesn't necessarily matter. Uh, we, can, we can always change that later as well. And the biggest advantage of the 3D document is that when we make changes to our 3D model, this will automatically update. Well, it has the ability to update. We can also choose it not to automatically update. So this is our base. Now I don't need to export this out of Archicad. The advantage is this creates it as a document that gets locked into Archicad. Now I can do a few different things to start creating multiple versions, multiple options of these. I can go into my, back to my views, I can create a new one, 3D document based on 3D, call it the same thing, lobby entry 3D, and this time instead of base, I'm going to call this hatch, with the intention that I want this one to be, have the hatching of the walls. I can create another one, lobby entry 3D, and I'll call this one shadow. Now I'm going to select this name, it's getting frustrating having to type it every time. You note that I'm making it and then I'm editing it. Right click, 3D document settings, now I'm going to go down and turn off my 3D vectorial hatch, I just don't want it again, and this time I want to turn my shadows on, on with contours. Now the origin of these shadows is defined by what my window and it's also defined by transparency which I've turned off so we also need to make sure we go in here and turn transparency on. So we have our base, we have our hatch, we have shadows and then the other one that I want to do is to get rid of people. Now getting rid of people is quite easy because that is just a layer combination so when we go to our settings, we can see this is the project map. We need to also create these as based on our view map. So if I go to, let's start with base, I can create a new view, lobby entry 3D base, I'll create it just like it is, and then I'll do the same thing, create new, but this time Command L, I can turn off people. So that's viz people. I'm not going to worry about layer combinations at the moment. And then I can recreate that. Save current view, base, and I'll just write no people. So now by just changing the layer combination or turning layers on, turning layers off, I can now choose to toggle between having people and not having people. 
In the next video, we'll then have a look at how to, once we've done some sketches over the top of these and animated them slightly, uh, adding in some organic elements hand-drawn, such as some plants, we can then look at how to recombine these, and we'll do that in Photoshop and how to touch it up using some watercolour techniques.